What's up, beautiful people? It is your girl, Linda Sims, the Who That Teacher from New Orleans, Louisiana, and I am back again with another line dance. Now, I put it on y'all yesterday with that smooth sensation and that footwork. So now, I'm going to give you a little easy peasy. How about that? Yes. I want to give a shout out to my lunch crew. I issued y'all a challenge, and that challenge was not to go out to lunch to spend money, to bring your lunch, and also to bring your tennis shoes and during lunch, instead of sitting down, taking these videos and dancing and getting some steps in, like 40 minutes, and then eating your lunch. And then at the end of the month, you're going to thank me because you're bank account is going to be full, honey. You're going to have extra money. All right. So shout out to my uh, lunch crew. Also shout out to everyone that leave me a comment. Thank you so much. I appreciate y'all. Some of y'all guys, I'm getting ready to drop some names. I appreciate y'all comments. Thank you so much. Thank you for the support. Uh, if you are interested in cardio line dancing classes in the New Orleans area, please call 504 Two five one zero six seven four. So this next line dance, I'm gonna teach you is by my girl Kima out of Chicago, K two C Kima's Kicking Crew, and the name of the line dance is Summertime K two C Summertime Shy. And I'm gonna give you the step by step instruction. It is a four wall dance that moves counterclockwise and it's thirty two counts. And instructors, I got some 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 tips for your beginners, okay? So, instructor, I still use my playlist where I do two and two. Two beginners, easy peasy, and two beginners in intermediate for those individuals that are coming. That's been coming for a minute. So just imagine you always get new new people. So what do you do when they come there? and you use the same playlist that you use for your beginners that's been coming a minute, they get overwhelmed. So what I do is I have a separate list where it's easy peasy. So I will do two of for the seasoned beginners and two for the beginners, the one that just come out in the door. So that means both groups will get a workout. So. The easy peasy is going to teach your beginners that line dance terminology without it being too difficult, without throwing too much at them, and it keeps them moving. This is one of them right here. And most of your easy peasy, you can just call it out, okay? Just cue and they'll pick it up. So this is a full wall dance that moves counterclockwise, okay? So it's 32 counts. So we're going to visit every wall moving to our left, okay? We're going to start with the weight on the left, and we're going to do a step drag, triple step. Five, six, seven, hand. Step, drag, triple step, all right? So people call it James Brown or whatever, but it's a step. You drag that left leg in and with a triple step. On the left, you do a tap, lift with a triple step, all right? So you do something different on the right and the left. You do a step, drag, triple step. On the left, you do a tap, lift, left, right, left, okay? Now we're gonna do uh, what we call a ballroom turn. So you rock back, rock back, recover, half turn, triple step. You rock back, recover, triple step with a triple step. So what you do on the right, you do on the left, right? Left, forward, right, left, right. Left, right, forward, left, right, left. Coming to the same walk, back to the front. And make sure when you rock back and come forward, it's a half turn, right, left, right. Rock back, recover, half, left, right, left. So don't overextend yourself. Sometimes you can turn too, too far and you lose your sight of your wall. It's each of them is... Both of them on the right and the left is a half turn. So let's put that together. Step drag, triple step on the right. Attack, lift on the left, move it up. Left, right, left. Rock back, recover, triple step. Right, left, right, that's a half turn. Rock back first, triple step. 
left, right, left, coming back to the front. Also, there's two ways you can do this. You can rock back, recover, or you can rock back and pick up with that left leg. Rock back, recover, triple step, rock back, recover, triple step. So you can do one or the other. You can keep the, your, uh, the foot on the ground or you can kick it up, okay? All right, so let's put it together. From the top, step, drag, triple step, tap, lift on the left, moving forward, triple step, rock back, recover, half turn, and then rock back, recover, uh, half turn. Five, six, seven, eight. Right, left, right, left, right, tap, lift up, left, right, left, rock back, recover, triple, right, left, right, rock back, recover, triple, left, right, left. Okay, now, so the next step is going to be a step, drag, triple step to the right and the left. Didn't we just do that? Yes. We moved it forward, but this time we're going to move side to side. Right, left, triple step, left, right, triple step. Check this out. I always tell my beginners, once you learn the basic line dance steps, it's the same steps to different music, okay? Here I tell them this, this step drag can move forward, right, left, right, left, right. It can move back, left, right, left, right, left. It can move to the right, right, left, right, left, right, or it can move to the left. Left, right, left, right, left. Okay? So, sometimes I'll do a step and my people are confused. And I tell them, you've been doing this step. So I think about the step that they did in another dance. And they're like, okay, yes, it's the same step. So this, the first one we did, the step drag, we moved forward. This time we're going to move to the right and we're going to move to the left. Right, left, right, left, right, left. Right, left, right, left, okay? So make sure you do that. All right, so let's take it from the top. Moving forward with our step drag. Five, six, seven, and. Right, left, right, left, right. Tap, lift up, left, right, left. Rock back, recover, half turn. Right, left, right, rock back, recover. Left, right, left, step drag. Right, left, right, left, right. Left, right, left, right, left. Yes? All right, now. So, let me just say something. I know I talk a lot, but let me, let me tell you why I talk a lot. Because I'm teaching different people. Okay? So, so be patient. Don't only think about yourself. But I teach people who've never line danced. So, that's who I'm talking to. So, when I'm a look talk a lot. I'm really talking to those people. You already know that because you've been dancing for a minute, okay? So this channel caters to a lot of people. So sometimes I don't talk as much and I, I don't explain things as much and sometimes I do. So I'm talking to every level novice, those who don't know how to dance, those who've been dancing for maybe a year, those who've been dancing for five years, 10 years, 15 years, okay? So just be patient with me. Okay, now let's, let's end the dance, okay? And, and it's time to go to our next wall. So this dance is called K2C Summertime Shot. Shot. So it normally is a, a basic on the left, but we're going to cross over right. Right, left, right. Left, right, left, shuffle, right. Left, quarter turn left, right, left. And that's the end of the dance. So we're going to turn to our left, okay? Cross over, right, left, right. Left, right, left, shuffle, right, left, turn, right, left. All right? And the last step was on the left, and the dance starts over. So we have the next wall moving counterclockwise, and we start at the top, moving forward. So let's move forward from here. Five, six, I'm gonna give you the count. Five, six, seven, eight. Up, one, two, three, and four. Tap, five, up, six, seven, and eight. Rock back, two, three, and four, and five, six, seven, and eight. To the right, one, two, three, and four. Left, five, six, 
seven and eight. Cross one and two, three and four. Shuffle five, six, turn seven, eight. Did you get it? Now, instructors, when you're doing that Chicago, a lot of people count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven, eight, or seven, eight, nine, ten. That's not, that isn't the count, okay? It, especially when you add the four shuffles, okay? It's one and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. Music is always going to, especially uh, R&B, is always going to be eight counts, okay? So you got to. It, when you so say, say if you do a Chicago basic, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. But sometimes they add another shuffle. Sometimes they go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven, eight. No, it isn't. It's one and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. Stay in that template. R&B music is eight count. The bars is eight count. All right? I don't know if you understood that or not. But I talk about that in my training class at the Northern Southern Experience. So anyway, let's do it one more time. Here we go. Step drag triple. Five, six, seven. Move it up. One, two, three, and four. Tap five up. Six, seven, and eight. Rock back. Two, three, and four, and five. Six, seven, and eight. To the right. One, two, three, and four. Left five. Six, seven, and eight. Cross one and two, three and four. Shuffle five, six. Turn seven, eight. Okay. The dance starts over that summer K two C summertime shot. So y'all can leave a comment and say I talk too much. Okay, that's fine with me. That's fine with me. But I also want to. I know there's some instructors watching this, and I always get questions how to teach this, whatever. So I try to drop some bars and give people, instructors, an idea of how to teach and how to break things down. So that's it. Thank you for your patience. I, I, I appreciate you. So make sure you check out, let's dance together, the demo. Leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. If you're watching for the first time, I know we don't talk this, this much, okay? So if you like this comment, make sure you subscribe. My name is Linda Sims. I am the Who That Teacher from New Orleans, Louisiana. I thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.